Some batters, they bat on off stump. Um, some batters bat on two leg, which is in between middle and leg. I take a leg stump guard. Uh, I'm a leg side player. I trigger into middle stump. So I know that if I stood on middle stump, I'd be triggering onto off stump, which basically closes me off on my stumps and uh, anything hitting my pads is probably getting a pretty good shot to, uh, to be out. So I stand on leg stump. I take my, um, my right foot into a trigger position on delivery onto middle stump. And then I know that my leg stump is down leg stumps. So I've got a free, free swing of the bat down the stumps. So I know basically on deliveries where the bowler's bowling from, what angle he's bowling from, whether the ball's gonna be hitting my off stump, whether the balls are right to leave, whether the balls are right to, um, to, to play at. I've got my pre-ball routine where I stand and uh, I just take things in. I always like to know where the fielders are, so you'll see me spotting fielders. Um, so at least internally I know where the fielders are, where the fielders aren't, where my scoring options are. If they've closed a gap, I've got to pull a shot away. It's also key and vital for my batting that I'm, I've got to feel the feel right. So obviously the feel on my bat has to be right. Um, I work on that pre-game. I work on that with just a few taps before I, go, before I go out and bat. And then it's just game situation stuff. It's trying to keep things as simple as possible and just watch the ball. So all of that is just pre-routine stuff, which is pretty simple, pretty ordinary, pretty normal, uh, and pretty easy stuff to do. The hard part is just focusing on the field, where the position of the fielders are, and also um, just in the ball. Even if you hit a boundary and you feel good, it's just a case of going down the wicket and just tapping away, thinking, right, that ball's gone, next ball. That ball's gone, the next ball. That ball's gone, the next ball. And also, then you also just take in the game situation too. So you'll be tapping away and you'll be looking at the scoreboard and if you're chasing runs, where's the Duckworth Lewis? If you're setting a total, where should we be? Who's bowling? You have a look at the field, you see if there's gonna be a bowling change. So there's all these different bits and pieces of information that you go through. I mean, most of it is just, it's just, run of the mill stuff. Um, but there are some occasions where you've got to basically pull yourself in. And there are other occasions where you've got to say to yourself, right, you tap a little bit harder because you've got to get uh, your foot on the gas.